Okay, this is a replication of Laser Saber's famous Easy Spin version 2 by uh, me on February 2nd, 2025. And I wanted to build uh, one like what I have running on my windowsill, which is the unauthentic one, and then put it under glass so the dirt got, didn't get in it, and uh, run it on an electronic circuit. Um, the files I found on Thingiverse. And I don't think Laser Saber posted them. I think somebody else posted them. But years ago, what he wanted to do with this motor was have people replicate it, study it, and provide uh, feedback on um, the pros and cons of what he's done. And um, it's pretty amazing. Um, anyone who's got 3D printing uh, ability, uh, you can find the uh, STL files on Thingiverse. Pull up Pulse Motor, search down. You'll find this easy spin that somebody posted. Um, I had to play around with the dimensions on this, and that took me a while because it's not very good 3D printing, but this is a smaller one than the original. And um, what it is, it's 12 coils in series, 6 magnets on the rotor. Uh, I've ordered the um, sapphire bearings, but right now I just got it running on a very simple plastic bearing there and a, a coin with a dimple in it on the bottom for the needle. Um, and what I wanted was something that... Uh, I could put this uh, glass over and keep the dirt out of it. And uh, this is the problem with uh, my original Easy Spin from Laser Saber that he sent me was it got dirt in the bottom bearing and finally started stopping. And the thing with these motors is um, on mine, it, it doesn't, um, doesn't self-start. When it's stopped, even though there's power in there um, from the solar panel, whatever you got putting the power in there, it won't it won't run unless you spin it up. Same thing with the reed switch. If this reed switch is in such a way that it's not clicking it, once it stops, it won't restart, even though it fills up this with the solar energy. So you have to spin it up. And in in my situation, this was good because sometimes I'll leave this alone for days at a time. And I need to know if it's stopped at any point in time. And that's how I know if it's been a non-stop running device or not. So anyway, I built that up. Uh, the files are at uh, Thingiverse. Um, and the pull-up uh, pulse motor, um, easy spin, laser shaver, easy spin. You'll be able to print this thing out. Fun project. Takes a long time to wind those coils. I ended up using uh, heavier gauge wire this time just to get one built. Uh, you need to use 40, 42 gauge wire for a real um, easy spin. Thanks for watching.